Amongst all of the things that we think about at the beginning of medical school, so the learning anatomy is the thing that most people imagine is the beginning of medical school. And we use the same material that I teach on in the medical school for the students, so they get that uh, honest appreciation for what's going on. Those people that are enthusiastic about it uh, get past the unusual uh, smells and, and the, the aspects that might put them off, but some people don't take to it very well and they need to know that right off the bat as well. So it can encourage students that are enthusiastic and it also can convince students that shouldn't be going into it that it might not be right for them. So they all get excited about it because I think the concept is kind of titillating to see human beings. But uh, uh, I found that because it's real material, they all of a sudden get very serious, they get very interested, they're a little uh, shy and tentative at first, but then by the end of the session, it's hard to get them out of here. Get in there. there. It's like, <laughs> you, live, you, I mean, you won't get a chance to touch a human it, brain. This stuff. So. Here we have the advantage of having all these pro-sections. So many times the students mm -hmm. are doing their dissections and processing and going through the material, so it's not available. We right. have these pro-sections, about 60, on, uh, on hand all the time. And it's a unique resource that a lot of different schools use, but I think that it really uh, engages the high school students and helps them uh, really understand why they're learning what they're learning in the books. I think the, the students benefit from it and also the, the faculty of medicine uh, sort of supports the community in ways that we haven't had an opportunity to in the past. And we're starting to get the payoff with that, with students that are getting into some of our elite programs like Bachelor of Health Sciences that with, with previously students from some of the schools that have never applied well, I don't think our students have the opportunity to see some of this as much maybe as kids from another high school. These kids, maybe they just don't have the opportunity. They don't have parents or friends, parents in the same field, so they can't just, uh, they're not exposed to it as much. You don't get the opportunity really to see how the human body works in high school biology. You just, you get to look at, you get to dissect animals, but you don't get to see how we work. You ever even imagine that you could have an opportunity in high school. So it's, it's definitely really, really neat.